Oh, uh, I wanted to play more of the, um, Pokemon ROM hack. <clears throat> it's from League of Legends. I don't know it. I mean, I know, I know what the game is. I don't know who the character is. I only play good video games like this one and uh, mm. but yeah, I don't know. I really like Pokemon Prism a lot. Uh, I kind of want to play more. I also don't. Oops, I messed that up. I also don't know if I should save it for the real channel. At least do one stream of it there. I don't know. It's probably going to be incredibly boring, but in retrospect, I stream kind of like almost every day. But if you are looking at just stuff on the main channel. You wouldn't think that. So, it's a case of like, either I should look into streaming just less here and spend more time, I don't know, doing work or something, or have more like off-the-cuff, casual streams on the main channel. Oh, I lost again. I like... it's not scan lines, it's... it's... crappy Game Boy Color LCD screen emulation. I think it's pretty good. I like it. It's like with the GeoCities effect. It's there to make me happy. So there. I want to pretend it's 2001 or whatever. Hurts your eyes, we'll get new ones. My eyes like it. Oops.
Oh, really? I'm gonna put that there. Uh, I don't play Puyo Sun because I'd have to load up a different emulator for it. I mean, it's fine. There's a PC version that's fully translated. play Puyo a lot. You can study guides that they have on the internet if you want to learn how to play the right way, which is not the way that I play, but like all of this is just from playing a lot of Puyo. and you get kind of good at it. It's kind of a cop-out answer, but... I have a copy of Puyo Tetris. It's good. It's just they've ranked me uh, at a point in the online multiplayer where um, it's kind of stressful. I mean, my win rate is still like 80 something percent, but. not like, hey, let's relax and play some Puyo. It's like, oh man, each one of these is kind of tense and kind of stressful, and if it's a case of, I want to play some Puyo for a bit, and just zone out, that's not really the, the game for it. Did I beat all the CPUs? Uh, I don't know if I did arcade mode. Got 100% in the story. The mode that I typically play for single player is the one where you just beat dudes one by one. And just have an endurance run of that. played a lot on the Japanese one as well.
It's not really a community discord. I mean, people have gone off and made their own. One that I'm not a part of. But uh, there's a Twitch thing through the built-in Twitch app. Whatever that was. The non-curse thing. That Twitch bought out and rebranded. Doesn't have invites that are open at the moment. I can dig out a link later. Uh, the tapes or the VCR loop will show up tomorrow, as will the cables and the adapters. I have the VCRs here. Uh, I don't have any tape, though, so I don't know if they both actually work. One of them's a really nice machine, actually. Uh, the other, I don't know. They both at least load a tape. Or how well they play them. I guess I'll find out tomorrow. One machine is a Sony and the other is a JVC. I don't remember the models. I think the Sony is like a HF900. I think it has a flying erase head, which means something. And the JVC is just like the most VCR looking VCR you've ever seen. It's the most bog standard thing. HRA61U, which is like the most generic looking VCR. It has some sort of weird proprietary cable port on the back. That's some unlabeled barrel jack port thing that apparently interfaces with a computer. 
for God knows what. Probably plugs into some sort of deck, if I had to guess. I don't really know what you'd need that for. It's gonna be a loop, don't don't worry, I figured it out in my mind. Actually the hardest part of it might be the most trivial part. Which is uh So once you start recording on one machine, it's gonna start pulling tape into it, and once you start playing on the other machine, it's gonna start pulling tape into it. And the thought there is like you don't want one machine be pulling tape while the other machine isn't giving any tape to be pulled. Like, you want it to be pulling tape into one machine and out of another machine kind of simultaneously, so somehow I'm going to have to figure out how to um, make sure they both kind of start at the same time. Which ostensibly is, you know, hit the button at the same time, whatever. But there might be some like, lag time before it actually starts up. How much slack should you give it if tape is, you know, kind of on the floor? Is that going to be a problem? And I have no idea. I'll figure it out. are all ROMs, so honestly, I only have like three versions, two of which are Puyo Tetris and one's Mean Bean Machine. Yeah, I, I could move them apart, but I don't really want to move them when they're recording. I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll set it up tomorrow and see what happens. Yeah. 
Well, I don't own those in terms of, like, physical cartridges. I don't have Kirby's Avalanche. I think it'd be interesting to stream this setup, but also kind of stressful. Because I'm sure everyone will weigh in on how to put it together and I'll have to figure out a place to actually record the thing and my apartment is sort of a mess. Probably not gonna stream it. Just want it to be a fun zone out tinker project. <clears throat> Rather than like, oh no, I also have to stream this and make it funny. It's kind of the point if you're going to stream it. If I get it working, I'll make a video or something about it. is an alien. Hmm. 
No, I didn't stream Pokemon, I just took a nap, which is almost as good. Fine, don't worry. I'm just worried about getting the actual thing put together. I care less about head cleaning at this point. Is there a PC fan game of that? I had no idea. Could they change the title to Dr. Robotnik's nice right or nice rice for nice rice device, excuse me. I've never seen this. Huh. And the first link is your YouTube channel, so there you go. Oh, it's Puyo Puyo versus two, but reskinned. Okay. Yep. Yep. 
I haven't played that in a while. Who even made Puyo Puyo Versus 2? Also, what happened to Puyo Puyo Versus 1? I don't know what to play. Ah. Boys to dads. I think I probably spent a few dollars on a game that is effectively a CD-ROM with a PDF on it. But who knows? Might be good. Softener, are you good at columns? Or are you just good at Puyo and Tetris? Never played columns before. Okay, so 
The answer is yes. That, it's, it's pretty bad as a game. I just didn't know if it was like... I just have all the Genesis puzzle games here. This sucks. That shouldn't even count. It's garbage combo for losers. Let's play the real game. Imagine how good we all are at chewing. You start with no experience, and now you chew like a champ. That reminds me, I have to play, or I have to buy more Soylent, so I can not have to chew anymore. Chewing is just a way for society to be enslaved, if you think about it. Because if you're moving your mouth to chew food, you're not questioning the government. Think about it. Yeah, I went for that risk and I only got a 9 chain. Oh, crap. I wish I rotated my pieces in more than one direction. That's such a liability, but I've just never trained myself to do it. One day I should just disable the button that rotates him in one direction and just force myself to do it the other way and just learn. And it's only a 9 chain because you're here. I would have been proud of it otherwise, but I just want you to respect me. I don't think I've ever gotten more than 11. It's my chain building technique is so sloppy. I need a specific piece now. If you're not giving me that piece, just throw it in the corner. And then eventually I just run out of corners. Oh crap. Oh no. Oh no, oh, oh. I don't care. Whatever.
Oh. That one. Wait, no, it's gonna hit that perp. Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, I thought I had a thing. Throw it in the trash. Wait, damn it. Oh, crap. I shouldn't have... I didn't... No. Oh. Oh, no. I think all the practicing in the world's still not going to prevent you from just doing something incredibly dumb and just ruining it.
I'm getting nines all night. Nine chain lifestyle. Finish. Oh, okay. Something for the sellout link. What is it? Oh, I already have one of those in there. Thanks for looking, though. Oh, I should not have done that or that. Nope. I gotta see if the washing machines are still open. Nobody went and took it. It's gonna go like 20 minutes ago and then I got distracted by video games. Maybe I'll do that now, because I'm just losing a bunch.
Oops. Uh, yeah, whatever. It's not what I want. Kind of screwed it up. Doing anything's a problem. Probably China who would make that. I always wonder what Chinese companies who have to produce outsourced products just think of the material they're producing. You have to make a hundred novelty fake butts, and there's just a poor Chinese person in a factory who has to put all these things together and has like no context for why they're doing it, why these are things that exist. Like, what, what are they assuming about our culture? from that crap. I mean, I've never worked on a factory that mass produces stuff like that, so I would assume maybe there's like a, I don't know, like a, a thing, some sort of seminar prior to them mass producing something, like today we're gonna make this, and it is this, and it does this, and that. Okay, there. I mean, they'd have to wonder, though, right? I'm sure an Amazon warehouse is full of every terrible thing. Hmm. 
Nope, I lost. Wah wah. Grow a boyfriend novelty item. No, nah, I've seen it. It's not weird enough. I should really look in the laundry. not what I should have You know, if you have no idea what you're doing in Puyo, just doing what the frog does and stacking everything up to one side is surprisingly effective. It's a good headline. Probably better than the article. I tried it once and it wasn't effective. No, I don't say it works all the time. It's like the equivalent of button mashing in a fighting game. Like, no, it's not... You know... Oh, God! It's not, um... A substitute for... Knowing how to play, but... That's all you can do. It's better than the alternative, I guess. Just punch the controller. Ouch. It's not supposed to go there.
Yeah, still same old blah. Positivity. Can't be bothered. Oops. Alright, one more. I'll do laundry. Ah, buttons. chocolate feed your depression unique chocolate gift set if you don't like your name eat this chocolate but that's a dumb thing to eat chocolate about you can just go to the courthouse if you want someone to hug you eat this chocolate like that but, no, that doesn't help at all. Directions. Use for increasing happy hormones. Chocolate's lied to me. Doesn't have any of that in there. supposed to say dark chocolate's the best. It's like a, a chef joke or a foodie joke. You know, if you want to be taken seriously in the secret club, you have to say you like dark chocolate the best. And they all just sort of like wink to each other like, huh? Yeah, dark chocolate, that's the best kind. Ha, huh? wink, wink. When in reality, like, nobody actually legitimately enjoys dark chocolate. And enjoying white chocolate is wrong. Like, that... Okay, you could argue dark versus milk. Sure, whatever. White chocolate, incorrect, buddy. 100% the wrong answer. Like, that's, that's not even an opinion that you can entertain. It's just so far out there. Tastes like sweet wax. Do I like classic rock? I'm sure. I love the Beatles. I love that one song that goes like, I want to hold your hand. It's what I write on my Dragon Ball Z fanfiction too. Oh. 
no one is more authentic than Kid Rock. Yes album. Uh, close to the edge, I guess. Or fragile, I don't know. One of the two. from topographic oceans because I'm pretentious. Oh, damn it! Okay. Nope, I lost. I hate all video games. All of them, they're the worst. Oh, let's go see if anyone's doing laundry at 12 o'clock at night, because if not, I'm gonna go use the machine. Ugh. I hope you got all that. Here, learn how to play Mean Bean Machine. Where's my phone? There it is. Ooh. 
Now that spider has a chance because you have to do this twice.
<clears throat> Excuse me. I don't think we put anything in cereal that isn't cereal these days. Or like you have to send away for it. It doesn't seem to come in the boxes anymore. I was thinking of Roller Coaster Tycoon specifically when I was thinking about the merry-go-rounds exploding. I'm 100% certain I was not mixing that up in my mind with another game. Uh, I don't 
give them. So you could either make them get rid of all gems of that one color, whatever one it lands on. Uh, you could make it push your side down, like push the junk that accumulates at the bottom down, or you could use it to raise up junk on the opponent's side. And I've just been typically using it to raise junk on their side, unless I desperately need to clean off one side. sucks. Mm. I don't really want to play anything. Controls are weirdly sticky, like it takes a while to actually start turning. It really doesn't want to. How's my time better than my rival's time? I was last. Oops.
And the problem is, like, listen, this is me hitting the right turn button. It's not doing anything. You have to hold it before he actually starts doing stuff. It's not as bad in the arcade mode, but they intentionally gimp your bike on this. Because they want you to do races and upgrade parts, so it sucks less. Oh, I, that's it. Muffler fell off. Oh no, I guess not. If you crash enough times, parts start breaking and you don't have a bike anymore. I wonder how they draw the road turning like this. Because you had racing games on the NES that could do that too. It looks pretty cool. My sponsor is the pharmacy. The frame, gotta be changed. Well, I don't have any money left. Uh, a friend of mine showed me something you can do with Road Rash 2. Uh, I don't remember how to get to the menu, but I know how to do it. You can break the music in Road Rash 2. Uh, if you keep picking a different bike. the ROM for it. I can dig it up and show you, I guess. Like, the audio can't keep up if you keep picking different bikes to ride. And the whole thing kind of falls apart. I never played RuneScape. Baltimore's gonna have a murder free weekend. Oh, here's hoping.
If I murder myself, does that count as murder? Probably not. Oh no, my muffler. Let's make it an accident. God, you could really see how much the frame rate takes a dive if you just look at the rate that the accident text flashes. Move it, chumps. Oh, wait, crap. I didn't repair the muffler. Whatever. the same course? says bird bird the spark plugs or the knock thing says spark spark but the second spark is actually backwards uh, I forgot the other one says maybe there's only two no I don't have the motorcycle cab Characteristic Genesis can't really scale sprites, but it's trying its best and everything is super jerky. Look. Two hundred fifty-five cars per train. No, I haven't checked out open roller coaster tycoon in a while. That'd be pretty neat. It's just I'm so bored of roller coaster tycoon scenarios. I feel like I've done everything that's going to be in that game. Unless I want to make the park look nice, but I really can't be bothered because I'm going to play it for a few hours, then never look at it again, so who cares? 
Ouch. If there's a good, interesting scenario, I'll give it a shot. I keep looking for them, but I never find anything that seems all that exciting. I did play it a lot, yeah. For years, it was just that in Oregon Trail. But people liked it, and it was fun, so... Good enough. When can I get another rival? I gotta be paid more than twelve hundred dollars. I want the doke normal. The brake gotta be changed. Change the muffler. Better change the tire. Like, when are you gonna get, like, twenty-four grand? Yeah, that's it. I need $819,000 for this engine. What? It's almost like a joke. Where does the money come from? How many times do you have to win? Do you have to get better times and then it lets you do it or what? in. Oh, so the thing about this game is that as long as you enter a race, you still get $1,200. So... Or, I'm sorry, 400 So, like, my bike won't drive... Oops. Well, whatever. My bike won't drive because the frame is broken, but they gave me $400 just for entering the race, so if I do that and lose by not moving three times in a row, you can just rebuild the bike. Column's music just makes me feel really sad. I'm not sure why.
I know what track Clotho is. Let me see. Oh, that one. hot remixes of this track. I never got through 17776. I looked at it, it seemed kind of interesting, and then I stopped actually reading it. This is the Beyond the Next Level remix, that's gotta be good. Yeah, that sounds awful. If it were just backwards, I think that'd be better. Okay. If you have a free copy you don't want, you could send it to me. I just re upped the P.O. box. It was expensive. T's okay. I'm gonna throw my clothing in the dryer. Here's my hot remix.
Fancy Pants Adventure isn't even that old. Sorry, microphone. The Halo PC demo was really all you needed for Halo. It had the best level in the game and it had online multiplayer, so there were hacks to put the other vehicles in, all that. I mean, people would still be playing the Halo demo today if Microsoft, or not Microsoft, if GameSpy didn't shut down and forcibly kick everyone off, but they updated original Halo on the PC, the full version, to uh, work sans GameSpy. I played it semi-recently. It's not good because everybody has god-awful mods where everybody dies in one hit and all the weapons are just snipers and rocket launchers. And it's not very fun, but... It's still there. I was meant to play Halo 2, but it needed Windows Vista or DirectX 10, and I didn't have that at the time. So I never bothered, and now that I have a computer capable of playing it, I don't care. Shut down my channel.
Yeah, that's still there. I don't know if there's a third-party Halo 3 PC port. I've never heard of that. The 17776 or whatever it is site reminds me of that weird Korean horror website where it's like a thing that you scroll down and it makes spooky noises and eventually it like locks control of your uh, scroll wheel and there's a creepy girl face in your face in the browser. I keep thinking it's gonna yell at me so I don't really keep reading it. Except when I saw that site, I was doing it on an iPhone, and it um, didn't load it correctly, so I just saw like a bunch of weird page formatting, and then like a weird portrait of a busted up girl thing with bad posture. It's like, oh, well that's weird. I guess it's like, spookier if you actually do it correctly. But... It's the last thing I need. Level select, right? Do I have a save state here? Oh, well, now I do.
debug mode in this version. No. Oh, there it is. Look, it's Sonic 3 and it has flying battery zone in it, but that's not in Sonic 3, that's in Sonic and Knuckles, and it also has the Sonic 2 level select background. Mushroom Valley? That's not in here. Either Sandopolis. Also has music that's not in this game. Like this. No, this is just Sonic 3. I did this on a real cartridge over the weekend. All the Sonic and Knuckles music is here. Except for... Uh... I don't know about launch base. Two-player mode actually has some really good music. It's a shame it's not used anywhere else. Oh, I played all the beta builds of Sonic 2. I got an internship at NASA. Oh, congrats. Congrats on going to space camp. sounds in this game. save the Pokemon game for something else. For a mainstream, I don't know, I might pick it up there. I'm not sure. I would have done it tonight, but I took a nap and wasn't upbeat. I 
Oh, I'm out of sounds. do this on hardware too, I checked. The struggle is figuring out what level this is. Oh, I think I know. It's the mine one, isn't it? I can't get down there. It's expecting... Oh, the box in the middle is for items. The screen would be cut in half, and that would show your item at the bottom. The problem is, um... The game expects half-height characters, and your characters are full-height. So, it, uh... It's just broken. You can't complete it, you're too big. falling asleep. This one might actually be completable. I think it is. Ah, uh, no, this part. I mean, I'll take more Amazon suggestions if you have any, but I haven't looked through it in a while. Maybe I'll just have a stream where I just do that and try to add more stuff to the sellout link. I'm too morose. And then I guess this isn't doable either. Oh, no, you can recommend anything. Go for it. Oh, <laughs> 
I already bought boys to dads. That's why on the Twitter picture it says you purchased this item. It, kind of, it depends what kind of wizard robe you want. If you want like generic medieval, I don't know. If you want like Final Fantasy, like white mage or something. Look on AliExpress instead of Amazon because you can get a lot of like cheap novelty clothing there instead. For. I didn't make force positivity, that's pretty good. Mm, no, I've never heard of Habitat. Check it out though. Hey, you could be Harry Potter. <laughs> These are all kind of. not. Not good. I have no idea what you're looking for. Maybe it's this. I hope it's that one. Well, I don't know. Like, do you have a reference image? Do you want this? It's like an overgrown raincoat, but there are also just holes in it. <laughs> what? What even is this image? Oh, it's two hundred dollars. AliExpress is where you go to buy a bunch of Chinese garbage you don't need that'll arrive in like three weeks. If you're looking to get knockoffs of stuff or unauthorized clothing slash outfit cosplay things, go to AliExpress. That's all I've used it for. Wizard clothing. It's not even a rope, just I mean there's there's that. It's a high quality male model. suit done. Here you go. Done. 
Wow, you have so many animals to pick from. What's the Lulu outfit count at? I only have one of those. I don't know why I'd have more than one. Wow, is that only $80? That seems like a lot of fabric. It comes in Donald or Daisy color. Did you find what you want yet? buy a lightning costume. Was that already 10 minutes? Jeez. Oh, it's still just broken in the background. Uh, I don't know. Let's see what they have for Sonic costumes. eyes on, right? <laughs> Just looks so sad and defeated. I, like, based on this, I just don't know where... Like, where does your head fit? Because this just looks like you wear it on the top of your head like a hat. And Sonic's eyes are just, like, popping out. Sonic Costume Adult. That one. I guess that's from an anime. You're not Sonic. Oh, I know it says cat, but like, why would you want Sonic's eyes facing upward? There, this one. Wow, that's really stumpy. Why does it have like a vent on the back? This also could work as your garbage costume. <laughs> Is that really the same? Well, it doesn't have the giant ring on the hoodie, though. This is just like poor man's rave gear. Not that many Sonic costumes. Except for this one. That's, uh. I feel really bad for the guy who had to model in this. <laughs> Color blue. 4,995 available. That's good. I can make my own army. Fabric type! Worsted. That's my favorite fabric. We used to have good fabric, but then we made it bad through the process called worsting. Large. Wait, why does this go... Oh, 5.9 feet. But that's not... Five feet, nine inches. Okay, that's a weird way to describe that. Send me a lightning costume. No, don't. I'll buy my own one day. Is that Knuckles, or is that just Red Sonic? 
Wait, so that's Sonic, Shadow, and Red Sonic. Which is not Knuckles. Oh. Oh god. Oh, these are all nightmares. Did you make yours or did you buy it? Oh. Oh no. <laughs> like at the end of the title it just says, SURPRISE! We have uh, approximately 146,000 of these. Oh, that's pretty cool. I just buy crap on eBay. We're here. Oh, it really wants me to buy the hot selling sexy stocking garter belt. I think that'd go well with this. It's not the worst. Okay, that is. I mean, he like stares into your soul, but other than that, I guess it's okay. This, not, not really. I like how they just label it as Red Sonic or Amy Rose, but they don't actually call it Knuckles. <laughs> what are they selling? Oh, like, are, are these the size of your head? Or are they... They look like something you'd put on top of a cup. Are these human-sized? Oh god! Ah. <laughs> what is... Why is it like an egg in an egg cup? has 100% photo. Check out our return earn process. Shopping process. Remember to browse. Then return them. Then they spelled return, right? Conform to the return rules. Success. Some of these are not the worst, and others are just horrific nightmares. I think that's just the still from the show. Also, why is it on the London Eye? That like they also just put a tag, or tag word fursuit in the title for this Barney outfit. Like, can you imagine being the guy who had to dress up as Barney and then go on the London Eye? As everybody just watches you. Maybe someone's into that, I don't know. They made this look more like a horse. Which... Features your favorite My Little Pony character, Canterbury. Age groups, adults, sounds about right. Oh, 
Oh, I'm out. Do you want to s anime costume products related searches like a swimming suit? Bohemian bathing suit, that's what I'm here for. <sighs> Sonic, Knuckles, and Green Knuckles. bad this hat looks. Like, why would you not just take a picture of it when it doesn't look like it's been stepped on? Also, they trademarked part of his eye. Great expressions. <laughs> His foot's on backwards. Sonic's giving you side eye. Look at how crappy this is. Why would you not take a better photo? Oh, okay. <laughs> What is that face? Oh, I still have the Princess Daisy plush with the weird eyes. It's sitting on the de or on my dress no, on my bookshelf with the Binky, the Cactar from the Lulu picture, and the leak from the Hatsune Miku picture. And the Korok. Uh, these are boobs. I'm sure they sell boobs on this site. In one form or another. There'd be more. I'm kind of disappointed. What do you think putting like Mario fur suit? Oh God. Oh. Uh. I guess that's what I should have expected. Wow. That's three hundred dollars. I need uh forty thousand. Oh, an extra large. That's about right. Thanks. Oh wait, there's only 10,000 available. Sorry. It's too many.
I wonder what would happen if you made that order. What's this? Why are they all in knockoff France? Hey, I added that to my cart. You got a problem with that? It's good to me. Oh, I can't order more than fifty thousand dollars. All right, forget it. Just throw it out. I'm gonna buy this shirt, because it doesn't mean anything. Obama fursuit. Wow. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Why is he just looking up constantly? No, it's like the real Obama. Ah. What is with the hair? Like somebody tried to punch holes in it with the hole punch and couldn't get all the way through. Oh no, don't zoom. Oh, stop zooming in. Imagine walking in to this warehouse every day and just seeing all these googly-eyed Elmos and Cookie Monsters and like really stoned out Barney and Garfield. Oh god, look at this is like a nightmare I've had. Look at this. Jesus. There's just Barney in the corner. What's this? The high quality of puppets, striptease, pig, swinish mascot costume, party outfits, fancy dress, free shipping. Why does it only have five boobs? Like, why did this one deflate? Source dolls. See, like, what does... What do the people who make these think? It even has a little sombrero, because I don't know. If you're putting this together, at what point in the process do you sit and think like, wait, why am I making this? Also, why is somebody buying this? Oh god! Why do they sell six of them? There's one in Germany, one in Romania, one in Russia, one in Spain, one in... KZ. Kazakhstan? And then Australia.
At least there aren't two of them in the same country. Oh god, there's so many! It's the thing about all these Chinese costume websites. Everybody reuses the same stock photo when you don't know if what you're getting is made at the same quality as other sellers. Because they all have the same picture. dress from here, it was alright. Is this an official minion? Or is that just like a really disgruntled minion? Cookie Monster. The Sonic leggings came from Amazon. And you probably bought them here. Oh yeah. There you go. That's the one. These have size options. Mine didn't. I didn't give them permission to use my stock photo though. That's on Twitter if you look. I wonder if this lady's actually wearing it, or if it's just like a photoshopped thing. It looks like she is. No, I don't wear these. If I wear them too much, then you have to wash them. And then they're just gonna run. And bleed. Is this Obama? Oh, it's... Putin? But... Also Obama? Oh, oh! You could pick the color of Putin or Obama. Sorry. Yeah, the white one. It's not really geisha exactly, but... That came from AliExpress. <laughs> I was looking for like a full-body Obama mascot... ...thing. I wish it weren't so wrinkled, but I was too lazy to actually get the wrinkles out before I posted it. No, they just have big cats. Sixteen inch or sixty inch super huge cat. Puyo knockoff cartridges. Pure pure, actually. Thanks for asking. Uh, 
Tetris? Oh. Ah, Tetris Camouflage, in case you're surrounded by really tiny Tetraminos, now you won't be spotted. It comes in two colors, Tetris or Camo. Nah, I never played Spyro. Yeah, what I'm looking at. Why does it have butt tentacles? Why do the arms just say Pepsi? I should buy one of these. Let's see. Color. Doritos costume. I didn't finish going down the Pepsi thing, though. Oh, wait, no, I did. I'm not gonna buy that. What am I gonna do with this thing? It's $137. Oh, Jesus Christ! Why? Wait. Wait, where do you see latex Doritos nurse costume? <laughs> do you make that up? Oh. Text Doritos nurse costume. There you go. Why is this pizza really spiky? Ah! Shakey's pizza. doesn't even have a face. This just looks like a vomit disc. they just put the cheese here and then have the sauce on the rest? Pizza pal! Whoa! Replace the logo and the pizza mascot. Don't mind if I do. Well, I guess I've already gone through all these. Tetris costumes either. Uh, did 
depression. Oh man, drugs. China powder. Wait, what? What is this? Oh, it's a poster. <laughs> Should buy that overcame depression shirt. My laundry is dry. <sighs> and I'm not funny, and I'm not interesting, and I'm tired. So that's why it's on this channel. Search something, then I forgot. Drugs costume. These are just nurses. Not interested. Can I buy a tombstone? I don't know. Probably not. I want to be buried, but not with a real tombstone. Just with, like, a fake Halloween novelty tombstone. Or get this granite router. Sexy Garfield costume. You have to... You have to specify whether you want... Uh... Garf head Pam body or Pam body Garf head for that. Sexy Garfield. No. It's nothing. Garfield women. That is not a good looking earring. <laughs> oh my god. That's horrifying. It makes it look like it's bored this giant hole in your ear. Jesus Christ. Like, here's Johnny, but with Garfield. How about this one, where he's red for some reason? And also has no arms. searching before oh. I would advise against buying a happiness is a warm puppy t-shirt How about 
Simpsons. Why does this one keep coming up? And this one, that's the second time I've seen both of these. <laughs> it's the thumbs up that make it. The thumbs up and the blank expression and the eyes that aren't on quite straight. Can you search for Bort? I don't know. This isn't anything that I searched for. Neither is this. Bort. No. Okay, these are actually kind of cute. And that's... No. No, that's not the kind of tingle I'm looking for. Okay, maybe I should just abort this. I'm just looking for a map. A map to Termina, not a map to the G spot. This dream is rated PG-13 mild sexual themes. Tails the Fox. Oh, nope, that can't do that either. Uh <laughs> That's pretty good. I don't know if that if that Man just photoshopped his eyes on the top. Or if there's actually just a hole in it. It's only $16. I mean, I've gotten a lot less banana for more. I think I'm just gonna get in trouble if I just start searching pregnant. Bad idea. Funny man. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why the background's pixelated, but then when he's all the way around, it's not anymore. 100% in-kind shooting man with the straw hat mascot costume man mascot human mascot. Great. Oh, it's from this store that has all the faces. I didn't do Asia old man. You want a little bust of former Soviet captain? Look up Pokemon cosplays. Seriously, this thing comes up all the time. Oh, these aren't even Pokemon. Wait, what is this? I'm trying to remember what Snivy is. Is that like the green starter from Golden whatever? Oh man. 
shame that's like two hundred dollars. And also, I would have no use for it. <laughs> Here you go, this is the kind of Pokemon cosplay you were looking for. Wait, what is... I don't know what that's suggesting. Yes, it has steam, or seams. Undertale cosplay. Seriously! Are these just sponsored links? Is that why they keep coming up? This does not translate that well to real life. Toriel. Oh man, that was such a good thing though. I don't remember where I found that. On Twitter I found a picture of somebody in like a giant Toriel mascot costume fursuit thing and they're just vaping and you just see the vapor just come out from like the holes underneath the mask. It's really good. Also, there's another Toriel in the background dabbing. Let's see if I can find it. Oh, these aren't the right pictures. See it, hang on. Uh, there's that, but that's not what I'm thinking of. No, this is something else. Uh, oh, this is what I was, yeah. That's uh, the picture I was thinking about. Isn't the internet great? <laughs> like every everything about this picture is exactly what you need it to be. <laughs> I I'm happy that it exists. I'm not happy about it, but I'm happy that someone's like, yeah, let's do this. At the Twitter account, Toriel Vapes. I vape today. I'm, I'm just really happy about this picture. It's everything I ever wanted. What is this? Oh, Jesus! Why did it get shot in the head? Why is it three hundred dollars? Dog. <laughs> Somebody draw the teeth in with marker. 
Like, you can see where they started and stopped drawing the, the outlines on the individual teeth. They don't have to worry about people sending them cease and desist orders to take all their crap off. I also sort of want some of these things. <laughs> I won't tell you which ones. These aren't as bad as I thought they'd be. I was hoping for more like weird looking Charmanders. Personality of Sesame. Oh. Why does it have JFB in the front, but not now? I'm looking for a costume gun holder for women, specifically? Holster? That's not even that bad. What's the problem? These are actually <laughs> pretty cute. Great. That's pretty good. Oh man, there's more. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there's so many! You could buy a lot of them for 50 bucks. Oh man, look at Gengar! That's great! get run over by a truck? Oh, he's dead. Can't believe Squirtle's dead. <laughs> Versus Berry. It's my favorite flavor. Uh, uh. Reshiram. Oh, these are just toys. Lame. Do you mean Ash figure? I did. Right. Yeah. No. I should get my clothing out from the dryer. I want this necklace of a boot. 
Wait, what? Cremation? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Is this... You put your loved one's ashes in the boot? <laughs> okay, first off, if you're carrying around my remains, you better spend more than eight dollars to do so. Second, why would you put me in a shoe? Like, what message does that send? That's like, oh, I don't know. I don't know where to put these... I don't know where to put Grandpa's ashes. Uh, I got some shoes over here I'm not wearing. I'll just pour it in there. It's like, you go back from the crematorium. Here's your loved one in like a Tupperware container, and they say like, okay, well we have a lot of urns that you might want to put this person in. Uh, go browse through our urn display case and uh, let us know which one you want to go home with. And you just say like, no, I, I got this shoe, just pour it in here, I'll figure it out. Come on. Family. Comic Sans. Which one of these people do you think's cremated in the boot? Is it her? Is it little Timmy? Is it... Jonathan? Who... I don't think these people made this child. Well... I guess they could. Most generic family that came with the frame family. His eyes aren't aligned. Eh, yeah, they're fine. <laughs> Impressivejewelry.com. I don't know about that. I want you to put my remains in the paw print one that's shaped like a bowling pin. Style, trendy. Color, Rose Gullod. Wait, wait, this isn't... That's not the same thing. And then this just says family again. Night then, psychedelicrev. Psychedelicrev. Psychedelic... Psyched. Psyched elicred. Psych Adelic Rev. I, I got nothing. Bury my pronunciation of your name in this pet thing. <laughs> Why do you want to walk around with that? It's hideous. It looks like a, a pepper shaker, but for ashes. Did, did the dog ashes come out of the whisker holes? If somebody walks around with my ashes, I'm gonna be so angry at them. Throw them in the garbage. Put them in this foot. <laughs> you think somebody who might like really like feet would like to be permanently immortalized in this foot-shaped micro urn? Or or what? don't know why you would do that. It endures lots of times wear, and even a lot of sweat. Oh. Keep my ashes in the mom in heart one because it's two dollars. Urn. 
Oh, they're just little urns. I want a big urn. I have a lot of ashes. <laughs> I want the trout one. The Sonic sound is great. I want an urn shaped like Sonic, and I want you to put my ashes in it and wear it around with you for the rest of your life. <laughs> God. Anime urn. Wait, wait, what were the autocompletes? Anime... Sex doll. Oh. I'm gonna go get my clothing from the dryer. I'll be back. What if you take the doll and you turn it into ash and you carry it around with you in the foot? What does that say about you? Figure that out at the time of return. Still wet. Put him in for another few minutes. Ashes. <laughs> Here's a set of multiple ashes. Uh, is that the Mucinex mascot? <laughs> oh, I can get it. Oh, these are 2016. Daddy since 2011. Right, there we go. <laughs> An extra, extra large to accommodate my dad bod. And then I'm gonna cremate the shirt. It might seem unlikely that such inexpensive products could be of high quality, period. But the company has a unique business model on its side. By choosing to sell solely online, it has managed to cut costs to a bare minimum. That's a weird thing to say when you have a picture of your store that has photoshopped merchandise in it. One inch equals 2.54 centimeters. Well, the length is in centimeters or centimeters or inches.
great. I guess I'm a small, which is not correct. I'm not, though. I'm like a large. I don't know what 150... Wait, these are different things. Like, these are... These are absolutely not... gonna give you the same number. So that's... So if I do height and weight, it says to get a large. If I do measurements, it says to get a small. I don't know what to believe anymore. If you're over 200 centimeters, I'm sorry, you cannot be a daddy. It's the daddy uprising. Funny shirt. Man. Six feet is too tall. You gotta shrink yourself. <laughs> I sort of want this. <laughs> It's so bad. Oh, God. Wow, that's... remarkably terrible. Gamer dad. Like a normal dad, only much cooler. Do I have a shirt that just says Dawn of the Dad? The Walking Dad? Eh, that's close enough. You ever just need a shirt that says Zombie in Japanese? Cause there you go! God. No. Oh. <laughs> what have you done to me? Ah, oh, he just looks horrified. That's only fifteen dollars. Ah. Funny gaming t shirt. There we go. Wear this to my dissertation defense. Hot male cotton. I don't have my defense scheduled. I don't have anything scheduled. I just put it in the theoretical future tense.
these are so bad. Man, they really like that Gamer Dad slogan. Caution, angry gamer. I just want to fill up my wardrobe with this, this, and this. I don't need any other clothing. Also this one. That's a good shirt. It's not... Why does... Why did they align the text so well for the first four lines and then after they just stopped caring? <laughs> what is this supposed to tell me? Arrives in 35 days. Style. Fashion. Hooded. No. Design? Yes. That's me. You're level up, brother. Brought to you by China. And Bangladesh. That looks pretty good. I should get this. Twitch TV. What? <laughs> sure. There you go. Twitching and beer. I think if you're twitching while drinking a beer, you should really stop drinking the beer. Living the dream. Twitching and beer. <laughs> oh, that's... That's great. The, the font is great. It's like a PewDiePie video. I don't know who this is. Or this. Actually a shirt. I mean it's not even centered. You could see the border they didn't cut out on Twitch. Like this hangs off the actual shirt. What is Blackout0704 not a Twitch streamer? Are you sure? It's this guy. <laughs> wait, wait. Wait. What? He has 102 followers. Why does he have a shirt? On AliExpress.
Can I get him on a shirt? No, there is no... <laughs> I'm a twitching dad! Is this supposed to be a stylized controller or a pair of binoculars? Also, this is a terrible shirt. <laughs> I'm a twitching dad! I don't know if it's about Twitch! It's only ten dollars to get this dead Yamcha figure. <laughs> Good to know I don't have to provide my own steaming crater. And I could just put it on my thigh. Or the grill, I guess. I shouldn't have been surprised. I'm kinda surprised they're all just <laughs> what It's not even you didn't even make this. You just you just stuck it on a piece of fabric. A picture of a piece of fabric. <laughs> a filter on it to make it look like it's kind of on the shirt. <laughs> I might actually wear this. We are Asia size. That's a really good shirt. This guy's pretty stoked about it. characters. Eh, that's not that bad. I could see somebody wearing that. Man, I should buy a bunch of these really god-awful shirts and then next time I have to visit somebody for a few days these will be the only ones that I have. It's like, hey, can you change out of that shirt? I, sure. How about how about this one? Is that is that okay? I should have brought this with me when I visited California. It's just... It's... It's not so bad that somebody could look at it and say, like, Wait, are they serious with this shirt? Do they actually think it's a good idea? Or not?
Oh man. Oh man, I can get a meme queen shirt too. And it's cheaper. Wait, did anybody buy these? There's one person in the US who has a Meme King t-shirt. I hope they meet up with the person in the Netherlands who has the Meme Queen t-shirt. Oh, you're not allowed to say meme. Understand. What? Why? Why is the S? I know it says send nudes, but why is the S broken? Oh, are you supposed to put your fingers there? Oh, oh, oh. I, I guess. I have to buy it to check. Here's pictures of people. It's for Buddy. Oh wow, a lot of people bought this and that's really sad. I want to get this, but have it just say, my summer car. No one bought this one, right? They couldn't have. Okay. No one bought this. That's such a good shirt. That's such a good shirt! I could be the only person with that shirt. Funny Goku. I don't want to have to wear them. I just want to see somebody else wear them. I want to see them deployed in real life, but I don't want to have to be the person to deploy them. Also, these aren't really funny.
This is okay. That's a pretty good shirt. Many grandpas watch TV. The best grandpas play video games. I'll, I'll throw that on my twitching dad t-shirt pile. Where is it? There it is. Here's this Dragon Ball AARP shirt. Did they just jack this from someone's DeviantArt? It's, it's not even funny. It's not even a pun. If it were like Dragon Ball AARP, like even that would at least try. This is just like, let's put two things together, I guess. I've seen all these like a normal dad, but so much cooler, etc. <laughs> what? What? Oh. Uh... Oh no. This is a legitimate good shirt. Oh man, they have different styles too, I didn't know that. Oh, these are all great! <laughs> I kind of... I kind of want to buy this. Uh, I wish it had the URL printed on it. I don't actually know. Shirt number four is just a shirt, though. It's $15. If I get it in bulk, get 5% off. Let's set up an order. Let's set up a purchase order right here. Oh man, there's a lot of other good ones. Great. They're all good. They're all good shirts. Oh, it's no longer available. Oh no, wait, is that because I didn't pick a size? Oh no! I need the shirts. Wait, was that always no longer available and I just didn't notice? Or did somebody buy it? You better not have bought it. In like a minute or two? I doubt it. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for lights. Thanks. Maybe they're on eBay. That's such a good shirt, though! Oh man, they're... they're all great! <laughs> How are they all removed? You're telling me I can't buy any of them? Great. Sad face. I, I actually would not mind a shirt that had the Sony logo on it 
the old Sony logo and then underneath it just said, it's a Sony. That'd be okay. Actually, just a shirt with the Sony logo on it that doesn't say anything. Just the one with the dots. That'd be a good shirt. I'd wear that. I can't believe I can't buy any of these. Twenty sixteen Swag Street. They're all so good. Every single one of them. Welcome to Sad Face. <laughs> I was gonna buy one too. I don't care if it was fifteen dollars. <laughs> oh man, and then the rest are just Pinterest. I mean, I know I am, but I didn't know the shirts existed until now. Oh man! Where's the search for this image? Search Google for the link. Something else. You idiot! I gotta find this somewhere. Um. There's a difference between just vaporwave music, which I don't think is great because it seems very lazy and not better than the source, and just like this, just intentionally god-awful looking everything with random bits of Japanese, Windows 98, and Sailor Moon. Like that, that's totally fine. By me. I can't believe the shirt is not for sale. I just noticed the emoji border on it.
God damn it, I can't believe this isn't for sale. Oh, is that the image? It's 500 by 500, though. Can't put that in a shirt. I mean, you could, I guess. Guess for this image, Tumblr. Is that right? It it might have been that resolution. You're probably right. I have no idea what that's. Oh, would you like some lean today? That's what that says. I could theoretically put that on a shirt, I guess. It's just not the same. Well, the Chinese t-shirts might be alright. Making it yourself has an extra layer of... When you look at a shirt like this, effort is not the thing you think of. Try using white fatigue. I didn't think about that. It's a good idea. Um, let's see. Like, if you have to go and print up your own shirt that looks like this, that's, that's far too much effort. Anybody can print up a crappy novelty shirt. But if you buy it from AliExpress, then it's okay. Then it's acceptable. Because then you found it. That's not bad. When it's upscaled. Actually, <laughs> this might be usable. This actually looks, I mean, okay, the Cheetos. Cheetos thing is a little bit lost, but it's okay, actually, on the whole. You, you might be able to work with this. It's even bigger than that. 
I, you're right, I could put my own Cheetos image, but if this were to be on a shirt, it, um... It wouldn't be that sharp anyway. That's not bad. You can turn the noise reduction down, which cleans up the characters and adds more detail to the Cheetos. I don't even know if you can make it out on stream. That's the original. That's the upscaled and sharpened. Oh yeah. You could notice. That's pretty good. <laughs> I'll have to look into it. As done as it, it's probably gonna be in the time I feel like giving it.
very tempting to print that shirt up. But I will have... I, I can't even imagine a single place I could ever wear it. Like, I had some difficult times with clothing where I was running out of clean clothing and my only option was the Undertale shirt and at least that you could wear in public and not be as ashamed. I think that shirt might be pushing it though. I forgot to put a green on it so this combo's not gonna work. Which is a shame, because it would have been big. Wear it to Twitter. <laughs> yeah, wear it to funerals. Great. I mean, I have enough things that I bought shared on Twitter, and then they sort of sit in the closet. I don't know if I need more. after this and then go to bed. Very tempted to go down to 7-Eleven and eat a giant bag of Cheetos, but... Too lazy. Also, they're disgusting. Express is kind of like the last vestige of like big internet commerce sites where there's just trash. I mean, yeah, I guess there's eBay, but AliExpress has so much more.
and it's fairly reputable if you actually buy stuff from it. out was only timed out for 50 seconds, so... <laughs> Most confetti dad ever. Oh, thanks, Amazon! Great social messaging keepsake for those urgent and important words of wisdom like kafefe. Date first available on Amazon, September 1st, 2015. That's not right. Ah, oh, you missed it! All the good stuff was on AliExpress, including this t-shirt. I'm never going to buy, because it's not in stock. I want this shirt so badly. Not that one. This one. But... It's not available. That's the problem. I'm not sure if it's worth all the effort to print up my own. Oh yeah, in the Twitching Dad shirt. I have so many tabs open for really good shirts. Not that one. Uh, that's the same one. That's not a good shirt. That's... Not a good shirt. That's... Now that's a good shirt. Uh... I'm a twitching dad, just like a normal dad, except more awesome. That's a good shirt. That's not a good shirt. That's a good shirt, because this guy doesn't even have a Twitch channel anymore. Twitching in beer. Another good shirt. Another good shirt. Another good shirt. Another good shirt. They're all great shirts. Crap. 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 I lost. It's, it's a controller, but it's stretched out. one, then I'm just gonna go to bed, sulk, or whatever it is that I do. Yeah, it's the same pieces in the same order. Let's not mess it up this time.
Yeah, whatever, it's good enough. the three genders, men, women, youth. Oh no, you're not allowed to say meme. It's blacklisted. I sort of feel bad where people just get killed from that. But at the same time, it's been there so long, I kind of feel like I can't take it off. No, Richard Dawkins is not allowed on my Twitch channel. Exactly. People were definitely depressed centuries ago. Circumstances of life were different though. power in the middle age uh dead i hope
I mean, who would want to live in the Middle Ages, though? It just sucks, and everyone's sick, and it's just dirty. Why well, lied? So there. This is actually the last one because I do not care. Screwed it up. It didn't count. Yeah, I'll get back to Prism. I might save it for a mainstream. I don't know. Just start a Pokemon game, like, halfway into it.
Get up!
I remember the philosophy shirt. Dumb thing. What's <laughs> really surprising is that people actually bought a couple of them. God knows why. You win. I'm done. Oh, did you actually buy that shirt? Oh, oh, you didn't. They're... They're not... They're not good shirts. I, I would not recommend it. I misspelled philosophy shop a bunch. Anyway, good night. Thanks for watching.